What's up, Pokemon fans? It's Stash Ketchum, and today we are going to open up a Knockout Collections box. So I picked this box up at a local drugstore, and if you're like me, you probably saw it and you were curious as to what was all in there, uh, which is why I'm doing this video for you guys today, just so you're aware of what comes in these boxes. Um, so this was $9.99, and of course we get the Lucario uh, foil card there that's showing in the window packaging. Uh, turn it over, and it does come with uh, two uh, Pokemon booster packs, a gleaming Pokemon coin, and three specially chosen foil cards. So I'll be curious to see what actually comes in this. Um, and as I said, it was $9.99, so honestly, you know, if you can get booster packs right now, um, especially right now in today's market, uh, between four and four fifty a piece, um, that's that's worth it. Um, especially, you know, whenever you're looking for some things to snap and you're not maybe able to get your hands on some of the, maybe the newer product. So um, we'll see what, what uh, packs actually come in here. Slide that out. And it looks like Lucario is actually loose and then there's some cellophane on the back. So let's see what that's all about. So there is the Lucario card. Now it is pretty warped uh, from being in there, uh, but it is a nice looking um, artwork there. We got 2016 Pokemon down in the left-hand corner. And then it looks like we get, okay, so we got Bisharp. And it looks like there's some more in here. So let's see, let's see what's in this. All right, so we got Bisharp, Hollow, and a Zoro Arc. Okay, so that's actually a really nice looking uh, card as well. Um, so we get three foils um, just you know, right off the bat there. Uh, so that's that's nice. I mean, three foils and then two packs for $9.99. Uh, so let's set those ones off to the side. As you can see, you know, those ones are a little warped too from being in there. That's pretty common for the foils to um, have that happen if they aren't sleeved up or anything. Uh, but those those are cool. I like that. A lot of, lot of color going on in those. All right, so here are the packs. We get Ancient Origins and Primal Clash. All right, so I actually have not opened up any, oh, we get a code card too, as, as uh, I think it did say in the back that I read. Um, so I did not open any Primal Clash in, or Ancient, Ancient Origins. Um, so I'm not even sure what the card trick is, so we'll have to, we'll have to check those out. Uh, so here's the coin. I'll just kind of leave it in there and just kind of show you guys what that looks like. So nice looking coin. And um, we'll just go ahead and do the code card for the uh, Knockout Collection. So as I said, this is the first time um, opening up Ancient Origins and Primal Clash. I don't think these are, you know, very high-end products. Um, they are older, older sets from the XY. Um, so I don't know, you know, what what kind of value they are holding. Uh, so as I said earlier about, you know, doing the about four four dollars, four dollar fifty cents a pack. If you're still getting some packs like that, um, I think it's, you know, it's still worth it. Uh, so let's see what we can we can pull out of here. So it looks like ready for some new tricks. What's it say? Hoopa EX brings new mythical mythical power to the Pokemon world. All right, so slide that out. I felt pretty pretty tight squeeze there. I didn't know if I left anything. Okay, we get Persian off the bat, and there is the code card for Ancient Origins. As I said, I don't know what the card trick is for this, so I'll do four uh, just to see if that is correct. If it's not, then no biggie. Um, nope, must not be, because that should have probably been the energy. So we get a Porygon Z. And that is a rare, so that might have been the big pull. So uh, we get that, no shininess going on there. Um, I don't know, there's the Persian that we saw earlier. And Cottony, Eevee, and okay, so we got a reverse hollow. Is that Vera, Vera Zion? Vera Zion, I'm not sure how to say that one, but um, nice looking card, but we did get a reverse hollow at least. Uh, and then we got the rare Porygon Z. All right, now moving on to Primal Clash. Now, I wasn't expecting a whole lot out of this, you know, to be honest with you. So I'm not not disappointed by any means. This was more so for all of you, uh, so you know if it's worth it for you specifically, um, you know, to pick up because you know we all collect different things. So there's the code card for Primal Clash. Um, we all collect different things. So you know, get what you want, get what you enjoy. Um, I don't know what this one is. To I'll do actually. Let's do we'll do four see in this one too with primal clash but oh so there's the rare rare again so it must be i don't i don't know what it is i'll have to go back and look in case i ever get any more of these um but uh there's a rare we get a repeat ball shrine of memories uh let's see anything anything tentacle and another reverse hollow barboach okay so barboach 
two, so two reverse hollows. That's an interesting uh, looking Pokemon there. All right, guys, so hopefully this helped you out on whether or not you want to pick up the Knockout Collection. Uh, again, we get the two uh, booster packs there of Primal Clash and uh, Ancient Origins, and then we get the three uh, foils. So it's really not a bad bargain. Obviously, it just depends on you know what you are collecting, if it's worth it or not. Uh, we did get a reverse holo, one out of each pack. So that pretty much wraps things up here, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and please subscribe for more Pokemon openings and news.